About a decade ago, we began to get a lot of uh, reports from the field, from hunters, uh, customers of our product that had uh, taken our products on once in a lifetime hunts like Grizzly in Alaska, where they invest uh, possibly tens of thousands of dollars. And uh, it was really flattering to get those kinds of reports. I mean, we designed the product from the inception for our military mindset. Uh, we wanted the product to be something we could trust our lives with. Uh, but it was really flattering to see the customers uh, have that same measure of faith uh, and take it to their once in a lifetime opportunity adventure hunts and uh, on things like dangerous game and report back, hey, we you know, shot this record grizzly bear uh, with a uh, griffin armament tear mounted suppressor or I shot a doll sheep you know, I got this once in a lifetime opportunity to uh, get an elk tag or a caribou uh, and just really impress it, impressed upon us uh, that the customers uh, appreciate the quality we put in the product. And uh, we, we ourselves uh, for a long time have wanted to go on a, a similar experience ourselves with the product. We spotted uh, an American uh, bachelor bull bison. That is a bison that's uh, not not the uh, biggest animal in the herd, but that is uh, maturing to a point of nearly being one of the biggest animals in the herd. So a, tr a trophy animal, but still in, in a, at a good age for uh, good eating uh, meat. And uh, we began to, to attempt to stalk that uh, buffalo uh, and we found him in the woods, in a valley, and we uh, pursued the buffalo because uh, that buffalo wasn't presenting to us anything but hindquarters. So we pursued him for probably a thousand yards. And, uh, and after the thousand yards, he broke into a clearing and tried to join the herd and try to blend in. And we were able to stick with that uh, animal uh, it had a pretty high uh, back, back line and, and it had a lighter brown color. And, and we were able to get him to break and present a shot to us when he joined the herd. And, and at that point, uh, slightly quartered away from us, uh, having studied the anatomy of the, of the animals in a pursuit of uh, an ethical clean kill, we dropped a 325 Love Revolution in uh, for a double lung shot, and that buffalo uh, dropped in about 10 seconds. The Bushwhacker uh, suppressor was designed for straight case hunting with support up to 4570, so calibers like 450 Bushmaster, 458 Socom. Uh, this suppressor isn't just for straight case hunting, it's a universal suppressor. Uh, so you can use it on a 45 or 9 millimeter pistol. You can take it apart and clean it, so that allows you to use it on uh, 22 rimfire. You can shoot it in 30 caliber, you know, rifles up to 4570. 4570, we felt, you know, really epitomized what this suppressor was uh, designed to do at the at the height of its capabilities. It's a classical buffalo hunting cartridge, and so it made sense to uh, select. Uh, the American Buffalo for our hunt, uh, but also it similarly made sense to select the, uh, the, the Marlin 1895 Dark rifle for that purpose uh, because this rifle not only is chambered in 4570, uh, but also uh, comes suppressor ready, threaded, uh, and has uh, a Picatinny rail for integration of uh, optics such as this Leupold Mark VI. Uh, in our SPRM2 mounts, which also afforded us the accessory capability uh, of the Wilcox Raptar, which is a little over the top. But with this 4570, even with the uh, Hornet Day Lever Ev Evolution ammunition um, and a three inch uh, high coincident at 200 yard zero, 
Uh, we still want to be cognizant of the range that we're taking the shot at uh, because ballistics do play a role. You know, the integration of the uh, shooting sling uh, helped us to uh, get the kind of stability uh, that we wanted for shots on a moving live animal, such as a buffalo. They really don't stop moving. So that, that really is why uh, the Bushwhacker and the 1895 Dark Series uh, lever gun uh, were selected for the hunt. The uh, Lever Evolution ammo uh, presents, you know, an ammunition that uh, is high performance, both in terms of uh, performance on in, in soft tissue and and on target, but also is loaded like custom ammunition for critical and extreme uh, accuracy capability. And I was I was pretty uh, confident with the Hornaday uh, Lever Evolution ammunition. Uh, the Hornady ammunition, I have to say, uh, definitely, just like the 1895 Dark Rifle, uh, far and away exceeded my expectations. Uh, if I had a shot two and a half, three inch groups with a lever gun and, uh, you know, high quality 4570 ammunition, that to me would have been acceptable performance. But to, to put two rounds within 0.200 center to center uh, and to see this round uh, penetrate 48 inches of soft tissue on an American bison and uh, cleanly uh, drop that buffalo in less than 10 seconds. Uh, that to me was absolutely uh, amazing performance. Is there anything else you want to say? Well, uh, all, all in all, uh, it was a really uh, exciting experience to uh, once in a lifetime opportunity to hunt an American buffalo. I never thought I'd, I'd be able to do that. And I really uh, appreciated um, Marlin uh, for making a great rifle, Leopold for making an excellent optic to, to pair it with. Uh, and, it's, and it's no secret that uh, we have a, a marketing partnership with uh, Hornaday. And uh, we really appreciate, uh, we actually bought this ammunition ourselves, uh, but we appreciate the ability to uh, talk about the ammunition uh, that the performance of, of the entire package I really feel like uh, every every part of the uh, of the firearm the the suppressor the scope mount the rifle you know the the, the Raptor even the Hornaday ammunition uh, very similarly paired as far as quality and that that's kind of the team uh, of parts that allowed us to have this great experience and we really appreciated uh, everybody involved. So, you know, if you work at, at Marlin or if you work at Hornaday, uh, thank you. Uh, also, I wanted to thank our customers. We really appreciate those stories and we appreciate the, the faith you put behind our product. And we want you to know that uh, that's no coincidence. We, we did intend uh, for that product to be just that dependable, just as dependable as you uh, ascertained it to be. In, in taking it with you. But at the same time, we do appreciate uh, you guys having those life once in a lifetime opportunities, having those adventures uh, and life experiences with our brand.